guys, it was good to bounce back on Saturday, and in the end, it was a, a very pleasing win. Yeah, it was. It was uh, very important that we uh, we bounced back and showed uh, <laughs> the fans that we have we have got pride in the shirt, which we we have got we have got that. And uh, yeah, it was a massive win for us, especially uh, after the sad news about Mick James. But it was important that we uh, we put performance on. We got three points for him. Hmm. And personal accolade for you. You were named captain. Thank you very much, Mr. Chris Barker, for that contribution. And you were named captain for the side. That's a proud moment for you. Yeah, it was. It was a. It was a. It was an honour to have the armband, and uh, it was important for me that we uh, got the win and uh, a good performance and clean sheet. Because obviously, you get the captain's armband, you you, you want to do it justice, and uh, we got an important win, and hopefully to move on to Tuesday. Now. Yeah. And every every player, particularly every defender, wants to lead by example, but it just does give you that extra little bit of an honour, I suppose. Yeah, it does, and it was uh, especially after Tuesday night. Um, personally, wanted to show that uh, you know we, we, we're desperate to keep clean sheets and we're desperate to defend goal. And uh, Tuesday night we let ourselves down, but um, we, you know, we got to forget about it now. It's important that we we, uh, we concentrate on the games ahead and stop looking back on it because uh, it's only going to dent our confidence. To keep looking back on it, so it's gone now, forgot about, and uh, we move on to Tuesday. And you had Mark Phillips alongside you. Again on Saturday, he everyone can see what he can do. He's a rock, and you know he's going to help the whole team. Yeah, he is, and he, like you say, he wanted to change it before the game, and uh, uh, we, it, it was a good sight um, to see him back. We, we you know we could do from last year, and um, you know, gaffer has got some important decisions to make now because he's got competition places everywhere. Yeah. Barks and Moles coming back, and uh, everyone's dying to play, so it's, a, it's a, only a good thing. And. Andy said it on, on Saturday that he didn't bring in Mark to replace anybody, it's just to make the whole group stronger. So now, with Glenn Wilson hopefully back again, there's yourself, Glenn, Mark, Chris Barker can clear, clearly play centre half as well. There's, there is a lot of competition for places. Yeah, the, the gaffer rang me on, on the Friday night and explained that he was bringing him in, and yeah. you know, you, you take it on the chin and you, you just want to make sure that you're, you're still picked. And uh, yeah. all the lads are doing it, it's not just the, the back players now, all the lads are fighting for their position, which is the which is way it should be. You shouldn't, you shouldn't just be guaranteed to play every week. And uh, so everyone's going to be putting in the, the, the hours and the, the hard work and training to ensure that they're going to be playing. Mm. And the three strong defensive performances of late, Lincoln, Gateshead and Alfreton, the team will need that sort of strength tomorrow night at Chester. Yeah, Chester's going to be no different to, to Dover. Um, they're, they're, you know, we're going to go there and we've got to be stronger, there's no doubt about that, away from home, we've got to have a work mentality going into the game. Mm. Um, the gaff will go over what, what they do and what they do well and what they don't do well, but at the end of the day it's just down to the players and, and uh, we've got to perform better away from home, there's no doubt about it, so uh, we'll be looking to go and do that tomorrow. Mm. And I think Chester have scored more goals away from home than they have at the Diva Stadium. I guess that defensive solidity frustrate them, restrict their chances and then hope that at the other end the strikers can do their job. Yeah, exactly. This is similar to us. We, we're we going to go there tomorrow and, and you know, we're going to first of all be solid. Yeah. Uh, we're going to work to be solid and, and then hopefully our, our attacking players can get on the ball. We've got Brett and Tom Derry done well at the weekend and got Jordan, Joan Gesson, Tristan, whoever it may be playing. Uh, you know, we keep doing what we're doing. They'll come and we, we, we will punish the team badly one day.